Scrooged on 4K. Um, yeah, last week I talked about Trading Places. This week I'm going to talk about Scrooge. Uh, these both actually came out on the same day, but I, I wanted to do them a week apart. And I uh, really enjoyed this movie. I've never really seen it the whole way through. I've seen bits and pieces of it. Um, if, if you don't know what this movie is, it's pretty obvious. It's a play on the you know Christmas Carol with Scrooge, but with Bill Murray. And it's a really fun romp. Like, there's a lot of great humor in this movie, mostly because Bill Murray. I mean, he's great. There's a lot of great uh, jokes that are just totally his sensibility and a lot of that stuff with everyone in this movie. They're all great. Um, however, the main thing with this movie that makes this movie really good to me, I think, is a social commentary. Uh, Bill Murray is a TV executive that is, you know, purposely trying to put the most crass things on the air to boost ratings, to, you know, just make him more profits, whatever, without really caring about the consequences. There's a, it, it's to an exaggerated degree. There's one crazy ad that he makes in the movie and the, this woman comes up to him and, and and she's like yeah this old lady died watching your ad because it scared her so bad and he's like that's great you can't make this kind of publicity just that that line uh, is just funny but it's also like there's some commentary there you know and I think it does hold up that kind of commentary does hold up a lot more where you you look at some of the trash Netflix's point pulling out you know I mean I you know I, I'll be honest with you guys I hear these conversations from people who watch a lot of Netflix and they're watching like crazy amounts of documentaries or mini series about serial killers or whatever and you're like cool but you're also like shit <laughs> it's kind of creepy that they make so much of the stuff and so much of it is very explicit and all that you know not that that content can't can't be good and or of value, but there is a level of like, ooh. So the you know this the fun social commentary in this movie of like what we're putting on the airwaves, and I think in this movie they're more talking about also how that can distract from the holiday, and I think that's also some commentary that still works, you know, because I feel like the more and more older I get the more and more you get distracted with what the actual meanings of these holidays are because you're always trying to uh you know get presents spend money plan your vacation figure out who's coming for the holiday who's not you know sort of thing and so I think there's some fun angles with that in this movie it's also this is a Richard Donner film and he does a great job directing this movie is it Richard Donner yeah Richard Donner and uh yeah, and there's just the ghosts are all really fun in this movie. It's a really fun movie with a deeper, deep, deeper, sorry, I can't speak today, level of social commentary and everything. And um, I have seen bits and pieces of this on Blu-ray, and it looked really good on Blu-ray, but the 4K is a whole nother level. It's the best this film's ever looked. Um, I do love this slipcover more than I like this, because this is just this, um, this poster here photoshopped and not very well they don't really do a great job of photoshopping it but you know it's a great movie i think this is a movie that's actually pretty underrated now that i'm watching it uh you got director's commentary by richard donner which i'm thinking this is an older um director's commentary because uh you know richard donner is no longer with us a christmas to remember Updating Ebenezer, bringing the ghost to life, the look, the look of Scrooge, on set with Bill Murray, and this movie does has a really great set design. There's a lot of really weird, impressive sets. Um, show West clips with Bill Murray, you know. So there's a lot of special features here that were not on the previous Blu-ray. So this edition is a must grab if you really love this movie. Even if you've never seen this movie, I, I recommend a blind buy with this one. It's 20 bucks, and if you're looking for a new holiday movie to watch that you've never seen before, or maybe you've heard something about, because this movie is well-known, but also not super well-known, it's a great movie. Definitely worth the pickup.